Yoren. I'm sorry, my son. I'm sorry. <laughs> Donan, I... I will leave you in peace. I... A shame about Yorin. Was one of us, you know. We'll take care of him and his father. Lilith and Astaroth had made a deal. And we were the ones who would pay the cost. Our presence was no coincidence. Everything happened exactly as Lilith wanted. We just danced to her music. Donan was... Shattered, his mind on grief, not her, not answers. No one knew what Lilith was truly after, or exactly what Astaroth had promised her. But we needed to recover quickly, and we needed to stop chasing her phantoms. Ready yet. 
Never have peace. Mm, shouting and cursing all night. They should run him out of town. Well, he's still breathing. He is lucky to be. That old man there, he claims to be Horadrim, but he drinks like an ox. He came to town days ago, looking for a servant of the demon Lilith. A pale man. It seems he didn't like what he found. Mm, I see. I will take it from here. Who are you? He and I met in the Fractured Peaks. I saw his pale man in a vision, if you can believe it. Enough. He's yours. Just keep away from the bottle, both of you. told me to meet you here, Lorath. Remember? Well, of course I remember. I'm just surprised you're not dead. Hand me that bottle. What happened to you? I was attacked, obviously, by vast quantities of alcohol, wielded by my own treacherous hand. <sighs> then they also been a brawl with the goats over this patch of mud. But I like to think I triumphed. Lorath, who is the Pale Man? <sighs> the Pale Man is... or was... Horadrim. Horadrim? Then you must know him. <sighs> I thought I did, once. His name is Elias. He was my apprentice. He was the one who brought Lilith to Sanctuary. It's possible that I did not take the news very well. What must we do then? Find him. Figure out what he's done. And then kill him. Listen. There's a woman here someplace. She has some messages we'll need. And I'm of no use to anyone right now. Could you find her? Enough time has been wasted. Oh, check around the inn. Ask if she's heard from the Orbe Monastery. from Orbe. 
Same as yesterday and the day before. But I have something else. Rumor has it a pale man passed through the Abaru Canyon some time ago. Fearsome fellow, dressed in black. After Lora's performance last night, I wager he'll want to know. His stupidity never ceases to amaze. Had he not murdered Rasma, Lilith might have been stopped, but now, now she has the key to hell. We can assume we should be looking for a door. Oh, Donan. The poor fool never could have guessed that Lilith would come for Astaroth, let alone offer his boy to it. But what does she buy in return? Astaroth hails from the realm of hatred, same as she. Perhaps she left something at home. Strange. I wrote to the Orbe Monastery the day I arrived. The abbot should have replied by now. Tekran spoke of a rumor. A pale man, seen near the canyons. The canyons? Why didn't you say so? We go at once. Oh, but we can't leave Orbe unchecked. Sod it. I'm off to the canyons. You can meet me there or go to the monastery. You seem reliable. Thus far. Do not prove me wrong. <laughs> Is he insane, you mean? Elias was an exceptional mage. He would plunge through fire and shite in search of the truth, and very often found it. Whatever truth he has found in Lilith, only he can say the why of it. The scholars of Orbe devote their lives to the study of forbidden knowledge. To serve the light, we must know the darkness, or some other silly platitude. I wrote to the abbot seeking insights on Lilith. His silence is most unusual. The man never misses a chance to speak.
All the crying and worry of Guran survivors are scaring off buyers. Let's have some compassion. I would rather have coin. Eyes can only watch so much. Forge awaits your return. to find a witness who saw Elias. Instead, I have a camp of dead merchants. They were slaughtered by demons, that much is plain. But none were summoned here. We should search the canyons. Could Elias have summoned these demons? Easily. And assuming he did, he may still be here. Stay close to me. Wait a moment. I 
I must wait a moment. They're coming to a hell rig. I will close it. Put them down. I must wait a moment. I do not have enough spirit. I'm not ready yet. Far too easy. These demons were burning. I'd expect more from a mage of Elias's ability. Let's search the house. Just wait a moment. I must wait a moment. Today, Master Elias called at my door. I had trouble with my words, so I showed him my carvings. He said he could see my pain in them. The pain of a lonely man who had learned to hate the world. And yet, our mother, Lilith, found me beautiful. He said there are others like me as well. And together, we will build the new world. What a damn mess. Burning hells! We're too late. Elias is long gone. This Genbar is our summoner. How can you be certain? Isn't it obvious? Elias finds Genbar alone, friendless, full of anger. So he plays him like a fiddle, offers him Lilith's love and a part in his grand delusion. Then he gives him tools to express his anger. Summoning scrolls. Very perceptive. Who knows how long Genbar has stewed in this madness. Let's hope he can still be questioned. Wait a moment. You for sending Master Elias to show me the way. I long for the day when we stand by your side and set the cleansing fire. Visitors. Did Master Elias send you? Master Elias? Well, yes, in fact, he did. Ours is a very important mission. We have something for the Master, but we had heard he was with you. Do you know where he is? Liar! Dirty pig's born liar! The Master has all he needs! Yes. 
ready yet. first. Gemba was expecting someone. It seems Elias has turned others to his madness. Taught them to summon too, I'd wager. You heard Gemba. The master has all he needs. They're about to do something drastic. And the good news? <laughs> Elias gave us a gift, remember? This demon he sent to kill us. It is unique. It requires constant feeding. Human sacrifices, in fact. If I cut open its belly, someone inside might hold a clue. Tell us where it came from. I must have it brought to Kedbardu for examination. Make yourself useful and head for the Orbe Monastery. See what's keeping that bloody abbot. Elias had a talent for persuasion. Convenient trait for a Haradrim, given our dealings. But he could be... relentless when he wanted something. Even cruel. In that way, he and Lilith are similar. Suffering. Bloodshed. To them, these are a means to an end. They will bring out the worst in each other. The dry steps have no Cathedral of Light, no Druids, and their capital city, Gulran, has been sacked. Many are vulnerable, just like Genbar. We must learn what Elias has planned for them. can only watch so much. Hmm, could salvage.
creatures run free inside. No one to hinder them. Rodrim, Elias, and I are not to be disturbed for the remainder of our- Lock the doors! What about the others? The other Do as I say! I need more spirit. Fear the dangers of our scholarship, but ignorance of evil. Unbelieve me. Unbelieve me. I shall keep it safe. And then. The Abbot. Open the door. And the pale devil smiled. He took the forbidden knowledge. Shh, it's all right. I've cleared the way out. Can you walk? There is no way out. What knowledge remains must never leave. And to evening I shall keep it safe, and into the night hereafter. We must protect the Archive. We <laughs> no, are not ready yet. <laughs> Not ready yet. I'm 
must wait a moment. Wait a moment. From morning, my eyes were opened, and I saw the coming darkness. Through the day, I have prepared to accept the burden of knowledge. Until evening, I shall keep it safe, and into the night hereafter. Deserve to burn with the rest of it. Where is Elias? Gone. He said the ruin of sanctuary was imminent and only I could help. He is going to summon a lesser evil. He took all he needed and then my scholars. He murdered them. He... Oh, my friends, forgive me. I'm not ready yet.
What did he take? Scrolls from the Forbidden Archive. He has the means to summon a lesser evil. Him what? Which bloody one? Where? Oh, we don't know, of course. Elias could cover the steps in blood, but a lesser could wipe out the continent, or worse. Come, Elias's pet demon is inside. Pray it leads us to him. He asked me endless prying questions. Frankly, I should be more concerned about your past. Trusting one so connected to Lilith is quite a risk on my part, and one I do not take lightly. Perhaps you are too young. The prime evils you should know. Diablo, Mephisto, and Baal. The lessers are their rotten kin. Asmodan, Belial, Andariel, and Duriel. Each of them has ravaged humankind since the dawn of history, and they will gladly do so again. It was protecting that fool, Genma. <sighs> this is Elias's work. But where is he? The answer lies in the stomach. <clears throat> this is delicate. A soft noble's hand. Elias would have to feed this thing with more than fancy boots. But that's someone's son. Or daughter. We should burn demons. This is wrong. Ah. This medallion bears the crest of the ruler of the royal house of Gulran. Former ruler. Obviously. That's enough, old man. The dead deserve respect. The dead deserve nothing when the living are in danger. Now Gulran has a new ruler, and we have Elias to thank for it. The dead may be worthless to you, but that medallion could bring peace to those two mourning. Fine. If we are to find Elias, then we must also travel to Gulran. Meet me there, and be swift about it. Oh, and avoid the city gates. Too many cannibals. Go to the cliffs. We'll find help there. Not ready yet.
I'm not ready yet. Good of you to come. Pity you didn't bring an army or siege works. Elias is here. Gone to the palace, no doubt. Behind the high wall with the gates barred behind him. We can't get through. You know who can. Zelaya. Chia. How many messages did I send? Huh? How long has Oyun been missing? Trapped in there with those butchers? She may be the only one left who knows of the tunnel. If she's still alive. If this tunnel exists at all. You don't trust me. Of course not. You're a thief. Useful years ago, true. But it's clear you have some other reason to seek this you? Not your business. If I were to look for Oyun, where would I start? She has a house in the market square. We were supposed to meet there before, but I couldn't get close. Try to come back alive. Not convinced this Oyun is worth the risk, but perhaps you'll prove me wrong. Here, yeah. have a little faith for once, old man. Just wait a moment.
I heard. Why would these monsters keep anyone alive? The prisons. Maybe there is a chance Oyun lives. Ready yet. Ah! 